The recent offensive by Carthage had created a situation in which the Punic power was now poised to take control of all of Sicily. Only one thing stood in their way, Syracuse. In Syracuse's darkest hour, it would be saved by an unlikely hero. When the Second Punic-Sicilian War broke out in 410 BC, Dionysius was among those to answer the call to arms. Syracuse was among the largest and most fortified cities in the Greek world. It had withstood the might of the Athenian expedition and since then had only further been fortified by the ambitious building programs of Dionysius. The Carthaginians made probing attacks upon the city, yet Syracuse too was able to mount its own sallies, raids, and ambushes. Chaos reigned in the camp as units overwhelmed the Punic forts on the hills while cavalry and triremes assailed the anchored fleet along the shore. Dionysius was in a position to destroy the Carthaginians outright. With the threat effectively neutralized, but not outright removed, Dionysius could continue to use it as leverage against his rivals and any who might challenge his rule. 